Hello and welcome everyone. In this video, I will introduce one more add-on that we have recently added to our Master Study LMS plugin, Upcoming Course Status Add-on. Using this add-on, you can create and promote courses that are not yet available for enrollment. This add-on lets you give a preview of the upcoming courses and a countdown to the launch date. We offer different countdown styles for different course cards. We really care about the opinions and suggestions of our clients. This feature is also created because of the strong requests of you. You can also contribute to develop Master Study LMS. I will put the links in the video description. In the settings of the add-on, you can give your instructors to enable the upcoming course status. Additionally, you can enable course pre-ordering so students can buy the course but they can't start until the specified course launch date. Last but not least, you can allow upcoming courses to be added to the course bundles. Now, let's go to the course builder and try to use the features of the add-on. Go to course settings, then reach the access section. Here you can specify the alternative text for this course will be coming soon, launch date, and time. In addition, you can allow email notification so students will get notifications to their emails. Notification emails about the course's availability can be changed using Email Manager add-on. Changing the visibility of the course author, category, rating, and a course price is also possible. Let's see how it looks to guests and students. Guests of your website also can get the notification by typing their email address. Students can turn on the email notification about the course's status like this. Course card styles with countdowns can be changed using Elementor. You can also enable the filter availability, which helps you to sort courses according to their availability. First, in the settings of the plugin, turn on the filter availability. Then, edit the courses page with Elementor. Add availability filter in the filter section. I hope you will like our new feature and this video tutorial. If you have any ideas to improve our plugins, do not forget to share. Check out the video description for links and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.